GH spoilers reveal that John has become a target of the law after his wrongdoings were exposed. Wanted and losing power, John understands that his time as a free man is running out. However, instead of fleeing or trying to resolve the situation legally, John decides to use his final moments of freedom to seek revenge on the man he has always resented, Sonny. John has never forgotten how Sonny ruined Karen's life, the woman he deeply loved, by dragging her into a world of drugs and degradation. The bitterness and hatred he has carried for years have now fueled John's desire for revenge. Even knowing that he is on the brink of ruin, John remains determined to confront Sonny, not only to find satisfaction for himself, but also to release the hatred that has consumed him for so many years. For John, seeking revenge on Sonny is the ultimate goal he must complete before facing justice. Sonny, one of the most powerful mob bosses in Port Charles, became the victim of a sudden and unexpected attack, sending shockwaves through those closest to him. The ambush took place one evening as Sonny was returning from a secret meeting. No one could have anticipated that this would be the fateful night for Sonny. The assailant had meticulously planned the attack, waiting for the perfect moment to strike. A gunshot echoed in the silent night, and Sonny collapsed. Blood pouring from a fatal wound. Panic spread throughout the community as news of Sonny's attack quickly circulated. General Hospital, a place that had seen so many ups and downs in the criminal world, now became the gathering point for Sonny's family and friends, clinging to the faint hope that he might survive. However, the situation appeared dire. Despite the doctor's best efforts, the injuries were too severe. Rumors of Sonny's death began to spread, and with each passing minute, fear and despair grew stronger. The Corinthos family, from Carly to Sonny's children, were devastated by the sudden loss. No one could believe that a man as strong and powerful as Sonny could be taken down so ruthlessly. While his loved ones grieved, the underworld buzzed with speculation about who was behind the attack. Sonny's enemies, from old rivals to rising powers, were all under suspicion. Particularly, John, who had always harbored hatred for Sonny due to Karen's descent into addiction and crime, emerged as the prime suspect in many people's eyes. With years of simmering revenge against Sonny, many began to believe that John was the mastermind behind this brutal attack. Maurice Bernard, who portrayed Sonny for decades, has decided to retire after Sonny's death is written into General Hospital. Sonny's departure not only marks an emotional end for the character that Bernard has embodied, but also opens a new chapter for the narrative in Port Charles. Sonny's death sent shockwaves through the criminal underworld. With Sonny's absence, the Corinthos crime family quickly became a target for surrounding enemies. Yet no one could have predicted that Jason Morgan, Sonny's longtime loyal right-hand man, would rise to take over as the mob boss. Jason, having been honed by years of experience and decisiveness by Sonny's side, now faces a heavy burden of responsibility. He must not only protect the Corinthos family and their empire from the onslaught of hostile forces, but also avenge the death of his close friend and brother-in-arms. John, who has silently nurtured his hatred for Sonny for years, now becomes Jason's primary target. Jason is determined to find John and make him pay for his cruel actions. Although Jason is known for his cold, stoic demeanor, Sonny's death has ignited within him a burning desire for revenge that no one can extinguish. Jason's ascent to becoming the head of the mob is not just a transfer of power, it is a grueling journey. He must face powerful and ruthless enemies willing to do anything to seize control, but with his unwavering determination and unshakable loyalty to the Corinthos family, Jason knows he will not stop until justice is served. Jason's battle with John is not merely a confrontation between two long-standing enemies. It symbolizes a fight to protect Sonny's legacy. Jason must continue the path Sonny built, and in his heart, this mission is not just about power, but about honoring the man who sacrificed so much for his family and community. The criminal underworld of Port Charles will never be the same again, but with Jason at the helm, a new and challenging future lies ahead.